Say hi. We're swinging and we have Finn. He's eating a stick. I can actually show you guys Grayson because I have him in clothes today. No diaper, he's commando, but. Has he got a stick? Silly Finn. Hi guys. So it's a new day. Um, tomorrow will be a week of potty training. Um, and I still want to give up. <laughs> um, potty training has not been going well at all. Grayson now tries to hold his pee until my back is turned and then he pees. So I feel like he's catching on like when to pee or the feeling of pee, but he refuses to go in the potty. I can get him to sit on the potty if I offer him an M&M and he will sit, but he refuses to pee on command, even though like yesterday he hadn't peed all morning and I knew he had to pee. And he was like crying, like it hurt from having to hold the pee. Um, and I kept putting him on the toilet, but he would not pee. And then as soon as I put him in a diaper for nap time, he pees. So um, I'm just feeling really discouraged about the whole thing. Um, it's also hard because yesterday I had my sister and her husband come over to visit and they brought their dog and we're obviously we're um, puppy sitting my brother's dog for a couple days. And so it's hard for me to give 100% focus on Grayson when I have all these other things happening. Um, yesterday, Grayson, all morning, he refused to pee at all that morning. So I wasn't able to get him to pee in the potty. And then in the afternoon, I was trying to get him to go, wouldn't go. Went outside with my sister and her dog and we were playing sidewalk chalk and he peed through his pants on the driveway, twice. So, I don't know, it's been really frustrating. Today I've been waiting all morning for him to pee. Sorry, they're mowing. Today I've been waiting for him to pee all morning. I put him in his high chair to have lunch and I went and did laundry while he was sitting there and I came back and there was pee all over the floor. So it's just been a lot more accidents than, than success. So I don't know, but we are outside. It's almost nap time. I'm hoping I can get one more pee out of him, but I don't think it's gonna happen. But um, this afternoon, we're not leaving the house. We're not gonna go outside till he pees. That's my resolve. So hopefully we can make it happen. I am not doing like, um, I'm not pushing fluids on him anymore. I'm just giving him the regular amount just to get more of like his schedule of when he's gonna pee. Um, he's been pooping in his nighttime diaper every night now because he doesn't want to poop in the potty so it's just a lot of resistance which i've read is a good thing it means you're on the right track but it doesn't feel like it so anyway i wanted to keep you guys updated with our potty training struggles um sorry if you're not into potty training these vlogs will be kind of boring to you but i'm just trying to get it done we have less than two months until baby comes so it's hard <laughs> <laughs> We're out in the backyard playing with water. Just got thin. <laughs> he replayed my snap. He did. <laughs> yeah, pee in the potty. Gray had a little accident, so he's got no shorts on now. <laughs> We're just playing with the hose. His shirt's just long enough that you can't really see anything. Finn's loving it. <laughs> They're having the time of their lives. <laughs> Anthony's off of work today. We're all playing. <laughs> Put it up here. Put it up here. Put it up here. Yeah. Do 
like this. What's that now? <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> he loves spinning. He loves spinning in the swing. Finn wants to go check it out. <laughs> He's like concentrating that he saw me. He's smiling. <laughs> he keeps saying, ready, ready. <laughs> hey guys, so I am at my 30, well it's just 32, I'm 31 weeks, but I'll be 32 weeks tomorrow. So my doc now my next doctor's appointment, um, I'm outside the building right now. <laughs> I have my mask with me. I think this is going to be a pretty standard appointment. They're just going to take my blood pressure, check my urine, uh, check my belly, and listen to the heartbeat. So it shouldn't be anything too exciting, but I will update you when I get back on how it went. Okay, so I'm back. Wow, that was like the fastest appointment ever. Um, it was literally like not even 15 minutes long. Um, I went in, I had to wear a mask. They checked my temperature, it was 97.2. Um, left a urine sample, um, they were dead, there's no one there. What else? They took my blood pressure, my weight, my blood pressure. My blood pressure has always been a little high, um, but it wasn't too concerning, I guess. And then my doctor met with me, she said all of my tests from my um, glucose tests went well, all of my, my hemoglobin was really good, she was a little worried that I might be anemic. Um, just because a lot of second time moms are, I guess, just because you lose a lot of blood. Um, and that was good, and I don't have gestational diabetes, so that's good. And we measured me, and I'm measuring on track this week. Um, well, I measured, I was measuring 32 weeks, and I'll be 32 weeks tomorrow. So I'm basically on track, which is good, because last time I was measuring a week ahead. We found the heartbeat, and the heartbeat is was 150 on the dot, so that was doing good. He was kicking like crazy. Um, she asked me if I had any concerns, and I just told her, like, my back has been killing me, and my left ribs have been really hurting, but she said it's just pregnancy and the baby, and I was just like, I just feel like he's really stretched out, and she's like, yeah, that's just really common, and um, she said the hospital's still the same. Um, Anthony can come with me, but no other visitors. She doesn't think that's going to change by September either, which is a bummer. And then, um, but Anthony can come and go, which is nice. But um, sounds like it's just going to be me and him and the baby in the hospital. But everything's going good. Um, my appointments are now every two weeks. Um, so getting closer there. It's crazy because I went from eight week. Um, in between my appointments to then three weeks in between my appointments and now I'm at two and pretty soon it'll be every week so it's just crazy how fast time is going um, this baby's gonna be here before I know it but it'll be it's good it's all fun and good appointment overall I scheduled for two weeks out so it'll be end of August no end of July <laughs> and um, yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.